theme to recover and revitalize education for the COVID-19 generation for today is a very important theme. Today, the Philippines and countries around the world celebrate the third International Day of Education. The celebration is extra meaningful and critical this year as the current global health pandemic led to an unprecedented education emergency, affecting 1.6 billion students in over 190 countries. As mentioned in the 2020 Global Education uh, Monitoring Report, governments everywhere moved swiftly to offer alternative solutions. But at least one third of the world's students were not able to access remote learning. The lack of resources, particularly digital devices and connectivity, and the absence of a dedicated learning space inside their own crowded houses mean that the negative effect of the health crisis in students' education and well being is highest for populations that were already vulnerable. The social, economic, and digital inequalities that are being amplified by COVID-19 pandemic clearly show that we cannot return to the world as it was before, especially in the standpoint of education and lifelong learning. We must not only recover, but also revitalize education for the COVID-19 generation. One of the most important realizations that we can come up due to the pandemic is the great significance of education and what it holds for individual learners, families, and communities. That's why we need to ensure that governments and institutions place education in the center of achieving the better normal. We aspire to have after this, we need to push for equality. We need to push for quality education systems that are more innovative, accessible, flexible, and more resilient to crisis. May this webinar organized by the Department of Education's International Cooperation Office inspire more open discussions and catalyze new partnerships on how to achieve that. How can we put education and lifelong learning in the center of Philippines road to recovery and transformation towards more inclusive, safe, and sustainable society? Maraming salamat po. Take care and have a wonderful webinar.